so whenever you're laying down somebody of my size your head's touching uh one side of the wall and your feet are basically touching the bars um it's it's very short it's very short in there um if you sleep with your head by the toilet it smells foul it's horrible you sleep with your head on the other side all you get is bright lights so i mean it's uncomfortable in there to say the least and then I I think there's one description you also said that if you decided to sleep, and we've got a, just a, a diagram uh, you know, up on the, the, the monitor here where you can see the toilet is at one side of the cell and the bars are at the other side and the bed runs the length. If you decide not to sleep with your head next to the toilet and you choose to sleep with your head next to the bars, did you say that the other inmates can, can actually uh, reach you, can, can reach through the bars and do something to you? Um, yeah, so that could be a possibility. I have only ever heard of that happening. I didn't have it happen to me. But the fact of the matter is, is Koberger won't have anybody in that hold with him with the charges that he has. It's extremely serious. Uh, they wouldn't take it lightly and put anybody else in danger. So when we look at the diagram and there's uh, there are, it looks to be several cells all next to each other and then sort of a common area with a metal table and there's a TV I believe in that common area that does not depict the maximum security area and is that correct Um no so if you look from where it says main gate to maximum security the moment you walk through that gate you are in the maximum security hold then right there in front of the main gate there is a gate through uh that that uh barred off corridor um where the tv is that's where the guards would always be the inmates would be on the other side of there so um all of that is the max security area and it looks as though there's a camera pointing into each of those four cells. So, and again, just to be clear, those four cells that I'm looking at, were those all four maximum security cells? Yes, they are. Um, so if there is four inmates in there at, at any given time, they will all be locked into each one of those cells for the duration of their sleep or if they all are, re if they're all confined to their cells, for periods of time, they will be let out one at a time for their rec time. Um, yeah, so there's different there's different ways they go about holding inmates in there, but usually, more often than not, a murderer would be in there by himself with nothing but his thoughts. And at this point, it's accused murderer. I do want to ask you about the 23-hour lockdown that you said uh, would be the standard protocol for somebody accused of rape or murder, which is the, the segregated area. Did you say that on mm -hmm. occasion they, they forget about that one hour, that the guards get busy and that, that the inmates don't even get that one hour out uh, to, to stretch their legs? Okay, so to be clear, I, 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 what I had said was is there is a possibility of 23-hour lockdown for him. Um, if he isn't locked down 23 hours, then yes, legally he is supposed to have an hour of rec time, um, no matter what, every day. The jail is okay. usually over the jail is usually overcrowded and there's not enough staff to be able to get everybody in and out for their hour of rec time so you either get it or you don't i mean it's pretty hit or miss so i okay. i doubt I that also, their priority sure i also want to ask you about the the, the rusty conditions because there's some you know pictures that were put out publicly the jail that didn't look too bad um but that might be right. one area of the jail the area of the jail that you remember that the max security part not quite so f fancy it, you, as you describe it very rusty very old G give me a bit more of a feel for that yeah so the pictures that are depicted online those 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 cells are general population areas and the governor was coming, so they dressed it up. Uh, I, they painted just before those pictures were done. They had inmates paint them for things like coffee. Um, the the maximum security side, though, I mean, the paint is all chipped off. Uh, it's rusty. The drains are full of nasty filth. Uh, it's mildewy in there. Uh, 
it, the ceilings are extremely short. It's just a small claustrophobic metal box and it's, it's not fun. I mean, it's not fun. It's no, it's no way for anybody to live who has, I mean, who's re reasonable. But the thing is, is that Latok County does the best that they can with the funds that they have. So it is not their fault. I'm not trying to put any blame on the county or anything for like that. It's just the sad reality is, is it's not a very fun place at all. And he's exactly where he deserves to be through the duration of this trial. Um, so the public is safe if he indeed is a murderer or 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 not. Um, he's just and that's I'm glad you he's said in a that. very secure um, place. Thank you for watching. Go to newsnationnow.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.